know. Did, so is that why, is that why, because I'm listening that you talk and you said, well, I didn't really, I never could, my father and I, we never compared ourselves to any other father-son duos. I really never compared myself. Is that why you didn't get caught up in what transpired in the 90s, which is known as the steroid era? Because, uh, go ahead. No, my dad was always saying, hey, you're not, you're not, you're not going to be the biggest. You're not going to be the strongest. You're not going to be the fastest. Just don't let nobody outwork you. Right. And, and that's it. You know, so when it came down to, and when all that happened, I was did the you, highest at the time, did you know it was happening? Did you know it was happening? No, I would, you know, I, like everybody else, like a, you see it on, I was like, huh? You know, when they read the, read the Mitchell report and I was sitting there like, he, him, a good stiff wind and he could be out of the ballpark. He didn't right. weigh nothing. But, you know, it wasn't like you see these guys, you know, in the middle of a locker room with a needle in, you know, a, right. in Saran. You know, they did it behind closed doors. They, you know, uh, 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 I mean, if you see a guy come in and he was 175 one year and he 225 the next year, you could say, okay. But what about yeah, the guy that was hitting 15 home runs and all of a sudden hitting 50 and 60 home runs? Uh, that isn't up a red flag. No, because I like for me, you know, I was always taught, worry about yourself. Okay. You know, you keep yourself right. That's the only thing you can control. Is when right. you look in that mirror, you can't, that's who you can control. I can't control what everybody else does. Right. Uh, you know, my thing is when I, I look at it and people say, you got cheated, I'll be like, it is what it is. I let it go. Because I don't want to go into a big old debate about it. But Do it make you upset? It, no. No, because it, it used to. But now people see that, okay, okay, now look what he did. And right. that's who I want my kids to be like. Right. That's, who, that's what I wanted. And all that's what I wanted is, you know, I can go in there and I can go anywhere. I can do a lot of things, but I don't have to worry about somebody go, hmm. hmm. And that was the thing. There was never any suspicion. Nobody ever had any suspicion. It was never in the Mitchell report. Nobody even said, even someone that might have had a grudge that wanted to tarnish your image has never said anything about King Griffey being linked to steroids, HGH, nothing. No. Mm -mm. Now, when I retired, all my friends said, hey, now you can use it for cosmetic purposes only. <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, what? I was like, what? You know, they were like, hey. But, you know, but it, it's one of those things, like if you're 25 years old, think about this, you're 25 years old, you have two kids, you're up and down AAA big leagues, this $100 vial of, of steroids, could keep you in the big leagues to make a half a million dollars. What do you think people are going to do? And oh, when sure. I pose it to, right, when I pose it to people like that, they go, oh, I never thought about it that way. But what happens is so many people listen to, uh, um, and, and, you know, the, the guys from Congress, when they start jumping in on, on, on baseball and stuff like yeah. that, uh, their grandfathers are telling them that these were the best players in baseball. Now those records are being broken. And now they're in Congress trying to, you know, Legislate. put their name out. Cause, yeah. And I'm like, you know, hey, I ain't part of this, even though I'm part of it. Right. You know, uh, but, you know, having a dad who, who, who was a all-star, not a superstar, it, it helps. You know, if you're right. a superstar, then you gotta, you gotta live up to, to that. Right. Um, but my dad was a, you know, a homebody, uh, you know, become six brothers. I mean, excuse me, five brothers, one sister, you know, um, my mom is, you know, five sisters, two brothers, and they live catty corner on a T street from each other. So when I got in trouble at my grandmama's house, I went to my other grandmama's house, <laughs> which was right across the street. But, you know, coming from a small town, you know, it, it helps because, you know, it, it's, you know, it's not like the, the big city, you got to be larger than life. Right. Uh, you know, my family came from a steel mill. So, I understood hard work and I understood that, that, you know, my grandfather, when, uh, you know, obviously he was talking about his pension being like $600 a month and this is what we're going to have to live off of. So I understood the value of, of money. Cause I'd be like, Hey, can I go get this bubble gum, this tops bubble gum? And all I really wanted was the bubble gum inside the, the, the actual thing. He was like, no, no, no. We're going to go through the cards. You're going to know who they are. Right. And, and things like that. But uh, no, the, the, there was no pressure on me about doing steroids. 
Um, Are you sad that some of the guys that you were close with resorted to that? Do you feel cheated? No, no, because now I, you know, I don't have that issue. You know, uh, uh, people, well, he used to do this. He used to be the best. We thought he was better. Um, Now they're like, well, he, he, his numbers show that as he got older, he wasn't as quick. Right. He didn't do certain things. Now, that's all I can ask is, you know, my numbers are based on, you know, my age, what right. people do on a, uh, uh, at the, in their age group. Right. You know, when you're 22, 23, you bounce back like that. You're 37, 38, you might want to take a couple of days off. <laughs> so how, do, how, how should we judge this era? Should the guys that put up phenomenal numbers, should they go to the Hall of Fame? Should there be an asterisk by any of those numbers? How should we judge this number? Um, because numbers you, are more important in baseball vote. than any other sport. Right, but we don't vote. Like, you know, a member of the Hall of Fame, me being personal, I don't vote. Do I think that there's guys who, who are Hall of Famers before all the, some of the accusations were, were – yes, absolutely. Right. Uh, you know, but, again, that's not me. That's, you know, somebody else. Right. You know, that's for them to decide. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button to become an official member of Club Shay Shay where we always do something before two something.